is up YouTube, Steve with Team Crew 111 here. Redid my Elemental Hero deck again. I wanted it to kind of uh, fit the playstyle of everybody else, it's kind of like on my locals and different things like that. Um, <clears throat> so I cited out some things, added some things in there. Not going to explain much because you already know a lot from my previous uh, deck lists. Um, so yeah, let's get right into this. Uh, one Stratos, that's obvious. Um, Oh, triple alias. Obvious. Double blow, man. I only run two. Just, uh, I'll tell you in a minute. Uh, one photon thrasher. I might run two since I, uh, brought my monster count down. And then one honest. Um, that's why I'm only running two bubble, man. And I might put another thrasher just because of the light targets. But this card is just, like, too good. Both of his effects are way too good. And he's just 1900 defense. Uh, traps. Or, sorry, spells. Double E call. Uh, double uh, Gemini Spark. I might run three of these because it's too good. Man, it's like. That's freaking broke ass card. Two power dualities. Miracle Fusion. Uh, one Super Poly. Reinforcements. Warrior Returning Alive. I, I, I saw one other person finally in an E Hero deck running this card. It's too good, because you're recycling through your cards, like your Stratos, it's just too good. Double MST, Hero Lives, which is like the most broke card in the freaking game. No, actually, I think that's like, Super Poly is like the best card in the game, because you can't stop it. This card's really good. Uh, Mind Control, I think more people should run this card, because it's just... It's mind Control, you just exceed. <clears throat> Dark Hole, Heavy Storm, Monster Born, and the new edition, Book of Moon. Because I guess this card's being like a staple now. Because it is good. I always knew it was good. But now everybody's using it. Let's go on to traps. Uh, two bottomless. Two deep prison. Two turns tribute. Two compulse. Compulse is my favorite. Always will be. Mirror Force. Fiendish. Call of Haunted. Solemn Brigade. And Starlight Road. Alright, that's it for the main deck. Um, extra deck. Token? No, I don't know why. <laughs> no, not really. But uh, Gaia, Tornado, F Zero. I might run two of them because he's too too good. Uh, Shining, which is perfect. Escridao, Nova Master, Shockmaster, which is so anti-meta. First turn Shockmaster is an automatic win. Excalibur, Blade Armor Ninja, Paladynamo, awesome. Uh, Maystroke, Utopia, Orboris, and Stardust Dragon. Side deck, uh, a few, uh, mostly hand traps. Actually, well, uh, not really. But uh, Maxi, uh, Effect Healer. Only one in my side deck, one of each, because I don't have room and I don't have a lot of room to take out like six cards in my deck, my main deck. Uh, Electric Virus, DD Crow, another hand trap. Two more hand traps. Uh, two Thunder Kings. I was main decking these, but they're not working in the meta against anything because he can't negate. Um, Special summons that start a chain, which like everything skips start a chain now. Uh, more hand traps, pop a plant, uh, Kaiku, uh, perfect card for his meta, just destroys everything, screws everybody over, everybody hates me because of it. Um, Fossil Dyna, and the one card that nobody runs, but it works perfect against everybody's deck, Soul Release. Why don't you run this? Why doesn't everybody run this? Like in Dragon Rulers or something, you get five cards out of their deck, out of their graveyard. Way too good. I, I'm not gonna go over it anymore just because it's mine. Macrocosmos, Light Imprisoning Mirror, nobody runs that, and then Mind Drain um, for like Dragon Rulers. Alright, guys, that's it. Um, let me know what you think about my deck. Uh, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll catch you later.